have a holly jolly Christmas. It's a good time of the year. Hype yourself up. Skibbity <laughs> pop pop. Skibbity pop pop. Why are you tangled? Hey now. Y'all know what time it is. Spooky scary Sunday. We didn't do last week. Uh, in fact, we didn't do a lot of weeks this year. <laughs> but we're doing this week. Gosh darn. Now before we get started, I got some things I gotta say. Alright. Bro, I'm ugly. I'm gonna do like a 2020 wrap up video. I feel like I got a lot to say about this year. And you know, just looking at the channel, uh, I, I don't even know how to say this. I noticed the severe lack of horror games. Why was it? Why haven't I been playing horror games? So tomorrow, I'm playing a horror game. Like we about to get back to our roots. If you feel me, we need more horror games and I need to finish Ghost of Tsushima. That's like the two things that I care about right now. More horror games, Ghost of Tsushima. <sighs> okay, feel a little better. Uh, merch is still live. So basically, if y'all haven't ordered by now, y'all not getting it before Christmas. So Represent was dope enough to allow me to extend the, the campaign. So fret not, you can still get these limited edition, you can still get it until the end of the year. So, cause some of y'all be like, I didn't get paid. Yeah, you got paid by now. Anyway, let's get it started. Um, I know y'all know what Spooky Scary Sunday is. If you don't know by now, you just subscribe. So go ahead and click that button. Like Dream says, it's free and you can always change your mind. But let me explain something to the unindoctrinated. Spooky Scary Sunday is the most prolific scary video watching series on the face of this website. And if you don't believe me, check the catalog, Chief. 37 episodes, 37, right? The series has been going on for like two years now. Why have we only have 37 episodes? <laughs> However, here we are. Spooky Scary Sunday is a show where every Sunday, go ahead, get it off, laugh, laugh, and get it. The samurai we gather as a beautiful tribe, the beautiful community that we are. We get together and watch some scary videos sent in by you guys via Twitter using the hashtag Spooky Scary Sunday. You go to Twitter, follow me at Corey Kenshin, use the hashtag Spooky Scary Sunday, and leave a link to the scariest video that you know. And if your video gets picked, you get a shout out. So sit back, relax, grab some snacks. Go ahead, get you some, what, what you feeling today? But I never ask y'all, what do you want to eat? That's right, because it's a video and I can't hear you, nor can I see you. What the freak are you looking at? Sit back, relax, grab some snacks. Go ahead, get you some better made potato chips, some now laters, and a great Faygo. Detroit snacks, baby. And with all that being said, first video. <laughs> First video of this week is called Secret Formula and it was uploaded by Meat Canyon. <coughs> this was sent to us by Bang Brawl Stars who said, Hey Corey, this is scary and I love your videos. So let's uh <sighs> let's see how they massacred yet another one of our childhood heroes. Another beautiful day at the crust. I'm out. I don't you think I'm about to I'm not watching this! Look! I'm tired of it. Another beautiful day at the Krusty Krab. Another day servicing the masses. Oh, Spongebob. Oh, they oh. can't get enough. They want more. More of that secret formula. <laughs> Bro, That smells good, doesn't it, Mr. Krabs? Uh, uh. Aye, it do, Mr. Squidward. It do? It do. <laughs> Why is Patrick- Sponge me, boy. Maybe a bit more of that secret formula. What? Is that good, Mr. Krabs? Is that how you like it? Aye. 
That's how old Mr. Krabs wants it, but the salty dog wants even more. What? You can take as much as you want, Mr. Krabs. Oh, don't leave me out. I need you, SpongeBob. Go on and get yourself a handful. Oh my god, it's so f***ing good! Flavor. Take it. I need more flavor. Take it all. Let me get a piece Take of the secret formula. Take all of the secret formula. Was that good for you? Did I satisfy you all? I, you did me, boy. But you're all used up. Drained me, lad. Our hunger is satiated for now. But we'll be back. I love my job at the Krusty Krab. I wouldn't change it for anything in the whole world. I make people happy. I fulfill their needs. Frankly, I don't think I could stop even if I wanted to. But who would want to stop when people love what you do this much? This next one is something different, all right? It's called Midnight Jog, and it was uploaded by True Horror Stories POV. Now, this was sent to me months ago, and usually when people send me good ones, like I look at it and I'm like, oh, that's a good one. I bookmark it on Twitter, but I can't find who sent me this. So if you sent me this, here's a Nutrigain bar. This, this is just for you. This isn't the same Nutrigain bar that I give to everyone. Dark is free. All right, so you're going out for a midnight jog. Um, you're trying to get kidnapped. I don't know why you would do this. Buy a treadmill, go to a gym. There are safer ways to do this. I'm sorry, this is just the world that we live in. All right, you just don't, you, you can't do certain things. Huh? What language is that? And it's a woman too? Bruh, you for real about to get like it's too many just oh my god Excitable. Watch out for that guy that ran in front of you. Where the freak? Where did he go? Yeah. Yo, this is creepy as freak, bro. <laughs> Yo, this is creepy, bro. I don't know if it's the sound effects. Yeah, I think I think it might be the sound effects. I'm tearing up right now. Dude ran in front. Turn. To... <laughs> okay, okay. Look, I'm I'm tripping. I'm tripping. Let me. My bad. Let me calm down. Let me relax. Y'all th y'all thirsty? I got some water. I. I say my grace. <laughs> yeah, this channel is lit. Yeah. <sighs> Stop turning away from him. Huh? Keep your eye on. Keep your eye on. Oh. oh my God! What the fuck? Seeing somebody back up that fast. This man says something. 
Yo, can we run that back? All right, this is the last time I'm pausing it. It's the last time. Oh my god, bro. Run into the street. I'm running into the street at this point. I'd rather get hit by a car. Why are you going to the darker? I can't see anything. Has it been one individual person? <laughs> oh my God! Why is he backing up? Shut up! <laughs> oh, that was so good. That was so good. It makes it scarier that he backs up. Like, come at me at least. Don't back up. I'm not equipped. It, it confuses my brain. Like, he just backing up? Yo, that, I love that. That was true horror stories POV. <laughs> Bravo. I might get a 10 week off of that. <laughs> This next one is called Sleep Talker and it was uploaded by Social House Films, which y'all know means it's gonna be a banger off top. This was sent to us by Samurai Sister who said, I have no words for this one. Are you serious? Tony Desca? If that's the case, I'ma need to put on my Easy Gang screeners. That's right. This video is sponsored by Belize. Hey, yo, that's next. <laughs> YouTubers gonna start sponsoring each other. <laughs> like, yo, <laughs> I give you $100. <laughs> you wear my t-shirt. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, he didn't sponsor this. By the way. <laughs> but, hey, hold up. I see what you're talking about, Burly Easy. I see what you're talking about. All right, this is for all my fan editors out there. That's one. Hold up. Here go two. Here go two. <laughs> I just looked at myself. I look so stupid. Hold up. This glass is dirty as freak. Show us some, Victoria. Hey, look at it. I just get hyped when I see. Sleep, sleep talk recorder. Enjoy your new sleep voice activated. I can't read. Freak! Okay, she's trying to get some sleep, apparently. So it just records? What the freak is happening? What was that? My junk started lagging, dude. to make 
make it up here. We're cousins. We're watermelon cousins. What is she talking about? All right. Um, am I supposed to be looking at something? Huh? What the freak was that? Yo, you know how annoying it would be sleeping with her? Like every couple minutes, she's starting a whole conversation. You just knocked out, like. She like, how much the bread cost? You like, huh? How many? How many are there? How many are there? How many are there? Hello. Listen. I'm asking, how many are there? Somebody gonna answer? Listen. Oh, heck no! Now we putting up nest cams all over the room, all over the house. I couldn't go back to sleep after I heard that. Are you serious? You have to find me. You have to find me. Where are you? Bruh, this is too much. Listen, get out of that house. You still there. So at this point, if something happened to you, you signed up for that. <laughs> like, you heard the door open. What the freak was that? Oh, that's her fingers. Anybody home? Anybody home? Ew, 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 ew. Where are you? Bro, my washer, my my washer. Where are you? Behind you. Ew. Wake up. Suit up. It's time. Get that light on, girl. You got a flashlight on in your own house? Turn the lamp on. I hear it down look hit different, but <laughs> I'm trying to focus. <laughs> oh my guy. That's a nice little warm up. Okay, that's how y'all want to start? Huh? Okay. <laughs>
This next one is called True Trick or Treat Horror Story, and it was uploaded by Horror Shorts Party. So once again, you know it's gonna be a banger. Now this was sent to us by Ladarian, who said, please reply to me, it will make my day. Well, your day's been made, brother. Take this positive energy that you feel. Take this moment and harness it. Harness it into a ball of pure, concentrated energy. Now absorb it and accomplish all of your goals. Ooh, they set in the mood. They set in the mood. Oh, <laughs> I know y'all see him. Narrated by none other than Terrence Nicholson. Voice acting is about to be on point automatically. Favorite voice actor ever. This story happened a couple years ago when I was in my early teens. It all started when I went to the movies with my friend Sam to go see the world premiere of The Dark Knight. Mm. The movie garnered a lot of notoriety at the time, obviously due to Heath Ledger's leading role as the Joker. I personally thought it was the greatest movie I had ever seen considering I've seen almost every Batman movie that ever existed. I decided to buy some Dark Knight merchandise at the <laughs> vendor Paris Nicholson shop <laughs> was located in the theater. What appealed most was how cheap the Batman masks were selling for. I didn't have a Halloween costume picked out for October yet, and neither did my friend Sam. Yo, we Easter both collectively egg. purchased one mask each and figured it would make for an easy costume to trick or treat with. I can honestly say it was an astronomical improvement from the cliche bedsheet over the head ghost I was last year. Mm -mm -mm. Fast forward to October 31st. Me and Sam both wore our Batman masks and began going door to door, looking for an opportunity to fill our candy sacks faster than any other trick-or-treater on the block. Trick-or-treat! Well, happy Halloween, Batman. Yo. I mean, Batman. That's it? Lame. What'd you say? Boy, I snatched that bag out your freaking hands. Get off my porch. That's it? Lame. Get the hell off my property, you ungrateful twerps! <laughs> the majority of the houses were pretty yeah. generous, with yeah. the exception of a few bad apples, to say the least. On this particular night, there wasn't many houses that had their lights on, which generally meant that they didn't really celebrate Halloween, or in other words, they weren't giving out candy. Facts. Me and Sam were understandably upset considering we'd been walking for at least an hour. I continued trick-or-treating while Sam began to head home through the pit located in the middle of the neighborhood. Why didn't I just stay home and watch Spongebob? The Spongebob never gonna be the same. Pit was just a fancy nickname for the forest reserve which was generally used for nature walks during the day. But me and Sam went there solely for the sake of a shortcut home. I began walking about half a block down when I see more houses without their lights on. Screw this, I'm going home. I eventually approached the pit while beating myself over the head for not leaving at the same time as Sam. Mm -hmm. As I entered the pit, I instantly had second thoughts of taking the longer route as this route seemed nothing short of irresponsible and dangerous. Yeah. I ultimately decided to man up and continue walking through the pit as I didn't want to prolong my already dreadful night. Why the hell did I have to take this route? I can barely see anything. Right. I knew I should have dressed up as a skateboarder. I would have been home already. I remember the pit being so dark to the point where I could virtually see nothing except for whatever my cell phone light was illuminating. <laughs> no! What the Not hell that was clown that? Again. I began walking faster as I could hear faint sounds of what sounded like a maniac clown laughing. <laughs> what the hell? Who's there? Who's there? At this point, I was so Yo, petrified, McDonald's I clone. instinctively dropped my candy due to the adrenaline rush flowing through my body. I couldn't care less about the candy, as I genuinely felt like my life was in danger. Run! Ah! That's when I saw the source of the laughter standing a few feet in front of me. It was a man dressed as the Joker from the uh... Batman movie I saw previously. He honestly looked like an exact replica uh... of Heath Ledger's with a hint of blood on his costume. What made this more disturbing was how casual his demeanor was. He just stood there smiling at me like my appearance was amusing to him. No. I didn't want to express the fear I felt internally, so I tried to playfully marvel at his costume and say, Hey there, I, 
I really like your Joker costume. <laughs> no matter how hard I tried to keep a composed poker face, my body language and mannerisms couldn't help but show the fear that bled inside of me. Bro. He then took a couple nope. steps closer to me as I began to cautiously take a few steps backwards. <laughs> hey man, what the hell do you want from me? <laughs> Why so serious? Happy Halloween. The man surprisingly Yo! walks past me while I watch him in complete shock. What the hell was that? Was that some real life joker? At this point, I continued walking home while looking back every two seconds to make sure the man wasn't lurking behind me. I eventually make it home and watch a couple of YouTube videos, uh. trying to forget the creepy encounter that just took place. That's when my dad pops into my room and asks me to answer the house phone. Hey, Mark, answer the house phone. Hello? Hey, Mark, is Sam still with you? That's when I felt my heart drop to my stomach. Oh, that was his friend. Uh, no, he left to go home way before I did. Oh my god, why would you leave without him? He's not even home. Sam's hey. parents ended up calling the police, hey, which fault. resulted in an entire block search party. What came of such an innocent Halloween night turned into a nightmare. Sam's remains were eventually found in the pit, with his face lacerated into oh! his and his head decapitated from body. I haven't trick-or-treated since, and I still live with the regret of not leaving at the same time as my friend. I informed law enforcement about the bizarre encounter with the man I saw that night. Call it speculation or whatever you want, but I know the death of my friend Sam had something to do with that sick man. Or, should I say, the Joker. My God, why? <laughs> why would you take my son from me? This is horrible. Why? are looking for any witnesses to come forward in the connection of a deadly homicide of a teen. The victim's remains were found at the local park observatory. The suspect is described to be approximately six feet tall, Caucasian, and was last seen wearing purple attire with a green vest and tie. Police say the suspect is described to have face paint imitating the Joker from the blockbuster hit The Dark Knight. If anyone has any tips, please contact your local Batman, where was you? you shall remain anonymous. Alright, Karen, Free? back to you. <gasps> oh, wait! She was from that other thing we watched! Oh, I love how all his animations are connected. She was from the other one! Look at him. Sick. Trick or treat! Well, happy Halloween, Batman. I mean, Batman. That's it? <laughs> Whoa! Y'all see what happens when you ungrateful? Lame. Get the hell off my property, you ungrateful twerps! tonight is called fate uber horror story Ooh, this is relatable we've all taken uber once or twice or why am i talking like this this was uploaded by classic distractions who has 1333 subscribers if this is good i need them to be at 5k it's so many slept on short horror film youtubers we changing that this was sent to us by mary liz the cat who said here you go bro love you if you love me, send my slice that like button. You do it? See, already off top. Production quality is there. Recorded in the rain. I appreciate the grind. Jasmine, is that you? <laughs> wait, wait for it. Ta da! Oh my gosh, Aladdin. In the flash, what do you think? Are the chances? I know, right? All of these Halloween themed <laughs> stories today. 
clearly Halloween. If not, these people are weird. Are Aladdin costumes in this year, or do we just have some sort of connection? <laughs> uh, I, I don't think they're that popular. I mean, no. at least I hope not. But yeah, it must be fate. <laughs> <laughs> must be. Goodness gracious, fate is definitely the right word. Hey, keep your eyes on the road. This is, this is kind of like our, our magic carpet guide or something, you know? <laughs> yeah. I so, think he's um, been following her. Where are you headed? A, a costume party or? Uh, yeah, there's a Halloween party actually at Little Trouble tonight, and they're having like a. And costume. all my friends are waiting for me. Ah, cool, cool. Um, will you and your boyfriend be competing in the competition or? It's like I think he's slid. You see how he did that? Like you and your boyfriend? Like y'all gonna? That's the sly guy way of trying to see if she's single or not. Be like, hey, uh, well, I'm already Aladdin, so maybe we could ride on our magic carpet. <laughs> It's just me and my friends, and no, no, we're not gonna do it. Oh, you, you don't have a boyfriend? Bro, no, if no, you're no. about to crash this no, vehicle. No, really? <laughs> Shock, I mean, I'm, I'm surprised. No offense, it's just, you know, you, you're so pretty and all, I assumed you had a boyfriend or something. Okay, all right, he trying. You know, for a second there, I thought he like ditched it for the party or something. It's, what? You know, something I would do. <laughs> If you were my girlfriend. He's losing it. You lost it. So you gotta crack some jokes. I was thinking, uh, you know, I'd be happy to tag along with you and do the competition. Ah! You know, the whole Jasmine and Lad thing is like fate, right? We, hey, we could win. We could win. <laughs> Thanks, but it's all right. You don't have to do that. You sure? I, I, I can make my own hours. Like, I, I want to. Yeah, no thanks. I, I really just wanna go with my friends tonight. All right, bro, chill. That's it. Stop. They just trying to be nice. So. All right. Thank you. By the way, do you do you always ride in the back of an Uber? Like you could have rode up here with me, like shotgun. Um, bro. Yeah, I just prefer to jump back here, um, ride along. Women, I'm so sorry. Y'all got to deal with this. Nice. Suit yourself. Thank you. Why are you not following the directions on the app? Ah, uh, don't, don't worry about that. Just taking a little detour. Nah. The state is actually slammed right now. Inside your info. Well, I'd, I'd appreciate it if you just stuck to the directions on the app. Yeah, and I would appreciate it if you trust me. So. Ooh. Excuse me. Canceling the ride right now. <laughs> I am afraid you cannot do that. What are you doing? <laughs> Give me my phone back. Are you kidding? It didn't have to be this way, Jasmine. It really didn't. Why does every girl do this? You know, they they act like they're, every they're super girl? into you, and then the moment you do something nice for them, they shut you down. Just like that. I, I've never seen you before in my life. Oh, he's seen you though. Yeah, of course you don't remember. Well, allow me to refresh your memory. You got that Jasmine costume from Target, didn't you? We, uh, we bumped into each other and locked eyes. What? What? No! I, no, we, we, we didn't. I didn't. I don't remember seeing... <laughs> don't be so naive. You wouldn't have looked at me like that if you weren't into me. If you didn't like me. I'm, I'm not crazy. Yeah. You're crazy! You think I'm crazy? You think I'm crazy? Yeah, I Is just said you you're crazy. Yes. You think I'm crazy? You want to see crazy, Clara? Oh, no. you want a bad boy? Oh, okay. I'll show you crazy. Here we go. <laughs> Woo! Is this crazy enough, Clara? We're in a residential! The speed limit is 20! I'll admit, 
It wasn't exactly easy to track you down. I mean, <laughs> Ow. those store records were. I just cut myself. One thing to get into, but don't even get me started in the whole background check to become a legitimate driver. Golly, so much paperwork. But it was worth it. Bro. You've been following me? Yeah, well, I hope that doesn't freak you out. I just knew I had to meet in an organic way. No better way than this, right? I've been waiting weeks for you to request a ride, and when that didn't happen, I just, uh, but I started to panic a little bit, you know? I was like, oh, what is she gonna do? And what is she gonna request? Her? And then, you know, I thought, uh, <laughs> Halloween might be the night. So I, I went and got this Aladdin, you know? And bingo, here we are. It's like you said, Clara. Fate. Let me out. Please just let me out. You're insane! Bro, You're stop insane! egging him on! Let me out! Please let me out! Please let me out! Maybe you are right. Maybe I am a little crazy. You're gonna love me. Ooh! You will learn to love me! You will learn to love me! You will not love me! You will not love me! You will not love me! How do you look at that? You can add to your destination. If anybody is ever in this situation, right? Chances are child locks is on them doors. You're not opening that door. But notice, there is nothing else impeding her from just jumping behind him and... The car is stopped right now. I'm telling y'all, y'all don't want to get caught in one of my headlocks. Ye dead. Abrir la puerta. Ahora. Don't forget to give me a five star rating. He actually took her? What? <laughs> That ending was so good. What the heck? I'm like thinking like, oh, maybe that he just was playing with her the whole time. She did. Classic distractions. <laughs> Guys, y'all hooked it up. That's a 10 week. That's a 10 week. Um, it was just a good combination of weird, creepy, the backing up one. Yo, ugh. SpongeBob. Ugh. And then this one? Y'all need another one next week. I need another 10. So send me the best. I need scary. I need it all. For Spooky Scary Sunday. My name is Curry Kinchin.